Right, first of all, you want to make a duplicate save. You don't want to save over old data. You want to have a backup. So save to new data, yes. Save complete. So now we have two of the same files. Now we close the game. Quit the game. And now we connect a pen drive to your console. Connect it. Now go to your save data utility. And once it's inserted, it should appear here uh, below online storage, USB device. Scroll down to Kingdom Hearts. Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep. Go into it. And now uh, you want to copy the latest one. You, we can see this is the latest one by the date, 30th. Yep, that's the right one. So we press triangle, copy, onto the USB stick. <coughs> And now that we copied it, we need to delete it because we need to place the file back here and we cannot if it's already here. So we delete the one we just copied. And it's okay because it's on the USB drive. Okay, now it's deleted. So now we don't need to turn the PS3 off, just go to pen drive, disconnect it, put it into your PC or laptop. And here's the file that appears into the root of your pen drive. There we go, we need to run Root for save data, run it. This will come up. Configure template. Do you want to configure it now? Nope. And now you need to make sure the path is in the root of your pen drive. And we'll click on it. So that's the save file. And then we'll click on decrypt PFD. Decrypt all files. You want to decrypt save data? Yes. And now it's ready for modifying. So we just leave that window open and go into the save editor and open up the save editor file.exe. And now we open it up. USB drive G, PS3, save data, and that's the folder. And then we need to change the file type from bin to all files and then we we'll click on the save data double click and here you go you see that's the file loaded of my save data now why I needed to do it is because I needed to modify the medals so let's type in 99999 something crazy and we'll click save so that's, that's the modification I want actually I'll do money as well 999999 Save, saved, and now we need to encrypt the original file. It's already open. So now we'll click on the file and we'll go to encrypt. Encrypt all files. Do you want to encrypt the selected file? Yes. Close it down. And now we can disconnect from the laptop into the PS3 PS3 still running go back save data utility USB device enter it triangle now what you will also see, you see the money it hasn't updated because we need to make modifications first, so we copy and see we wouldn't be able to do that if we didn't delete the original file so once it's done, copied Run the game again. So now if we press continue. This is the new file that we modified. And once again, you can see that the money has not updated yet. But if we go into it, load a save game. Now we we'll go into the menu. You see the money is updated. And if you want the save file to reflect what's accurate. We just save it again, and again, I advise just make just save it over a new file. Obviously, you don't have to keep saving onto a new file, just but just until it's updated. The information here, just save it over the new new data, 
and you will see the money will appear correct now. So if we click on save again. Save. And you can see the money is now correct.